A new version of the Horizon display just arrived for me guys. The version is 8825.5. What are the new things? Because this time Samsung included a proper change lock. Three new things improved. Google Sports related GUI. This stands for graphical user interface. Added Google Sports settings guide and added notice text in now bar settings when app notifications are turned off. This version has been released on the 5th of March and it's 30 megabytes. And I wanted to show some things that I find kind of interesting. Now, first things first, where is the setting for the OS on display? Just enter your settings, scroll down until you find something called lock screen and OS on display. If you have one year, it's seven, which means you probably have the S24 Ultra, one of the betas, better four, or you have the S25 series, with the One UI 7 stable. Inside you're gonna see always on display and also now bar. Inside you're gonna see the always on display here and the now bar. If you click on the always on display, the best way for you to verify uh, that you're on the latest version is to just scroll down and find about always on display. From here you can see that the version is 8, 8255 and the latest version is installed. If that's not the case, then you can always go back to the Samsung Galaxy store and if you're lucky enough, find the new version. Now, these are the settings for the always on display, which is interesting because we have another setting for the now bar, but when you click inside the always on display, you have a setting called show now bar that will allow you to get the now bar on and off. Let me demonstrate something, guys. So I'm gonna go and turn my clock application. I'm gonna do something uh, very straightforward. I'm gonna go and put a stopwatch. So, the moment I minimize my stopwatch, guys, boom, yeah, then the new now bar pill is here, which means that if I lock my phone, right, always on display, boom. This is something that I really like because the things running on the now bar will actually be shown with real-time information on your always on display. And I have disabled my wallpaper for the always on display so that you can see how it looks like. This is not my lock screen. If I'm to double tap, this now here is my lock screen. I can stop it. Right, resume it, which is kind of cool. Now you're gonna ask yourself, why the hell I'm showing you this setting? And of course, this also relates to one of the new settings, which is getting sports from Google shown on the now bar, right? So now this thing is here as a live activity, you can turn it off and on. But I wanna show you something else. Now, for this test, I'm going to run the clock, all right? And you can see, by the way, now when I minimize the clock, it's going to, be rendered as the now bar appeal. I can go on my always on display and boom, here is the clock, right? Now, when I go back inside the now bar setting, I'm inside, you can see I have clock. So from here, I can just turn it off and on and you see that the clock peel here is just going to boom, go away. But one of the new settings relates to something new, which might be interesting. And for this, I'm gonna do the following. I'm gonna go inside my clock application. I'm gonna go to app info and I'm gonna go to the notifications and actually remove the notifications. So now I've disabled the notifications for my clock. You see, I will not allow this, all right? Why am I doing this? Because now when I go back inside the live notifications from the now bar, I can see clock, right? So. Now my clock is turned on and off, but nevertheless, now bar knows that I have disabled the notifications and it tells me app notifications are turned off, which is cool. And this directly relates to the new option number three, added notice sex in now bar settings when app notifications are turned off. Now to illustrate how this works, if I am to go back and do the same thing I did just a couple of seconds ago, resume my notifications and the moment I now go back inside my now bar, boom. Okay, now it's working. So I think things like this, very small, very tiny, at the end of the day, they might really improve the way you are using your phone because you might have disabled some of the notifications for some of those apps here, like the clock or the voice recorder or Samsung Help, and you might not know, and you might be like on and off, on and off, and wondering like, why, why is this not appearing on my now bar? And now bar will tell you if you have disabled notifications. Okay, this was it guys, for more videos like this, just go and watch some of my older videos. Stay safe, VST over, and bye.